this is a homemade powder and it doesn't has anything I extract but it is all raw natural pure I figured out from all over India you can make it too for that you need to respect yourself and have love for yourself efforts lena padta hai bhai so this is today's physique check and how do i have such pretty beautiful skin i don't shower with bullshit soaps what do i use i shower with milk don't believe milk baths only so if you want to figure out how i have already made a video on this you can go check it out here and if i can even you can start taking bath with milk and ignore those bullshit chemical wala 20 rupees wala soap what if every content or every movie generated would be a motivational movie movies on upsc examinations movies on olympic level athletes movies like bhag mil ka bhag influence is the only reason why people make movies the people who think about the realm of money exactly no they care about power not money and imagine how the world around you would turn if everybody around you would give only and only shit about cracking the upsc being an olympic champion being the the best version of themselves being the best cook in the world there would be so many more people in the army there would be so many more better relationships but the problem is people like to watch hedonistic bullshit time pass low quality dopamine hit movies and that's the reason when the quantity of the people wanting bullshit content is more the production of it is more that's the reason life is always a balance just like the 3% of the money owned by the people in this world is exactly similar to the rest 97% in this world which category do you want to be in it's absolutely and utterly fine if you want to be some homeless man because even he is free he's not paying any tax he's living free to his life satya hai but if you are living once who does not wants to choose the best for themselves so from the next time think twice when you try to consume some bullshit content and push those agendas because subconsciously deep down in your mind you start thinking that way that's one more reason why you should subscribe to this channel because all we care about is self improvement and nothing else everything in life can be a double edged sword just like content content can really make you pro keep waste your time scrolling 24/7 ruin your relationships have heavy expectations and no outcomes make you feel absolute insecure watching those six packs big tts big booties and at the same time there are kids literally 14 freaking year old making millions of dollars just by producing content life is all about making the right choice do you want to be a consumer or a creator and for the matter of fact i don't mean i am not a consumer i do love consuming content but what content adds value in my life does a random person making bullshit jokes about life on the reels add any value in my life i mean it does make me happy or make me laugh for some time but isn't that cheap dopamine hits isn't that useless and adding no value to my life i'll rather watch some content on how the federal reserve banks work i will rather watch how the inflation is going to kill everyone you have the exact 24 hours like that kid 14 year old is making millions of dollar through creating content so boiling down to the conclusion the goal should be either you create content if you want to be a content creator or you consume contents which add only and only value in your life also i wore a random t-shirt and i was trying to head outside home but my mother today stopped me and she's like harish today eid hai wear something nice she made me wear this so also eid mubarak to all of you guys i thought of not sprinkling scent today rather why not just try some attar today special on the occasion of eid and then something crossed my perspicacious mind what if i tell you i can literally save you from having skin cancer yes there is something you are doing right now which can cause you skin cancer and only your favorite harish guy card can save you from it so basically this is my scent ka collection and this is the attar i put on today what i was trying to say is whenever you put on a scent or a deo an attar do not put it on your raw skin on your armpits on your chest or anywhere else you want to put it on right i know the old school is absolutely and utterly against this because there are also studies which have proved that attar or scents or deodorants due to the crash and the stupid market the products they use 
into full of bullshit heinous chemicals which we cannot even pronounce if you put it on your skin studies have shown that you can literally get skin cancer and also lower your testosterone but if you are like harish i still want to put on my favorite attar i want to smell all beautiful there is a trick you could get some natural attar buy it from a place you can trust from i know it will be a little more expensive but being natural is more important away from all the chemicals and you rather put it on your clothes because it's going to smell more as it is outside the layer of your body and it is closer to the person you will be around it is logically more closer to the people you are around and you will also not have skin cancer problem solved so smell great anyway just by making a little adjustments in your actions you are welcome thank you so much for watching this video and if you have still not started with your self improvement journey don't worry you are watching this video that means you already have and in the end all what matters is you believe in yourself and take action now